channel again so guys in this video we will see how to fix the green blue fantasy relink audio issues and sound cut in and out so guys if you are facing this error so you are not alone many have player having this issue and in this video we will find some solution to resolve this issue okay guys so guys let's start so guys first of all you can check your audio driver so the audio driver issues in the game you can often be attribute to outdated or corrupted audio driver so you can updating them can ensure that your hardware communication effective within the game potential and resolving the audio cuts in the green blue fantasy and you can press the windows key on your keyboard and type device manager after that press enter and expand the sounds video and game controller section then right click your audio devices and select the update driver and you can search automatically for the update driver and follow the on-screen instruction and you can restart your computer after the update to ensure the change take effect okay so guys these are the steps for updating your audio driver then we have the third option so guys third option is change pc system sound settings if you if the audio cuts out when the ps4 controller is disconnected and reconnected the issue might be the with the pc and switching the audio outputs so manually setting the correct output can resolve this issue so you can right click the speaker in the system tray and select the op open sound setting and under the output you can select your preferred audio devices from the drop down menu if you are using the controller so you use the headphone and make sure your output device is set to be the speaker or headphone then you can test the sound in the game again to check the issue is be resolved or not another step is adjust the game audio setting sometime in the game setting can cause the audio issues so you can adjusting the audio setting within the green blue so you can launch your green blue fantasy and relink and go to the game setting and menu and navigate to the audio section then adjust the audio slider for the music and sound effect and dialogue to see if the effect audio cut out issues and experiment with the enabling or disabling any surrounded sound or special audio effect to see if the problem is being resolved or not then we have the fourth option so guys fourth option is disable audio engagements so windows audio engagement can sometime interface with the game audio you can disabling them may helps to with the audio issues in the green blue fantasy so you can right click the speaker icon in the system tray and select the sound then navigate to the playback tab and right click your default audio devices and select the properties then go to the engagement tab if you don't see engagement tab so you are looking for the similar setting in the advanced tab or under the additional device properties after that you can check boxes that says disable all the engagement or disable all the sound effect then apply and then okay and set to the game audio again okay then you can restart your game and check the audio will be work or not then we have the another option is restart the griddle below and relink and end your device so restarting the game can device resolve this temporary glitches okay so if you are using the pc so you can just close by the uh, your shortcut key uh, and using the taskbar is control shift escape okay then you find the game and click on that and then right then right click and make it to the end task okay then also step is you can go to the start menu and go power um, icon and restart your pc so these are the simple step for the pc's restart and ps4 you can press the ps button to open the quick menu and select the close application to exit the griddle blue then turn off the ps4 completely by holding the power button at least 7 second until you hear the beep after ps4 is completely shut down you can unplug the power cord and wait a minute then plug it back in and turn on the ps4 and you can relaunch your green blue fantasy another step for the ps5 so you can follow these step for the ps5 for six step you can contact with the support team so guys six step is contact with the support team so if you follow all the step and you do not find any solution so guys you need to connect with the support team they will be provide a better solution and troubleshooting step of your problem so guys thank you and have a nice day and subscribe our youtube channel for the further informations